Hey Matt, we're here. There's your dad. Um, it's a great neighborhood, as you can see. V right on a cul-de-sac. Very nice neighborhood. Um, the roof is okay. There's no leaks inside. It's just dirty. It needs to be power washed. Um, the house, has, structurally itself, is pretty good. It's been vandalized. Um, the garage door is like a fiberglass. It's really crappy. Um, when you come in here, it's tiled. This is almost like a bedroom, but it's not. It's part of the living room. It's like a living room. As you can see here, it was vandalized. Um, it's got newer windows, which is a plus. Um, what else? The doors, you know, are okay. This was also spray painted and vandalized. Um, it's got this other floor here, which would be okay, except they didn't lay it down right, which is why they used quarter round. That's quarter round, that little piece that sticks out. Um, they didn't put the, uh, the right uh, junction there. In here, they still didn't put the quarter round or anything. But anyways, that's that floor. But uh, besides that, I mean, you can see that. All this writing here. I mean, it's got nice French doors. Uh, you would have to spend a good amount of money to fix the kitchen here. As you can see, kitchen is destroyed. It needs all new cabinets, all new appliances, pretty much everything, except for maybe the plumbing. Um, the lighting, everything. Everything needs to be redone in the kitchen. Um, the, let's go on to the rooms. I couldn't even find the air conditioner. That's where the air conditioner uh, box was. The rooms here, also vandalized, obviously. Um, the floor, again, like I said, it's not really finished right. Bathroom. Speaks for itself. Now this is a really good neighborhood by the way, but you know, look at that. I don't know if you can see that. That's the drain. Obviously there's not supposed to be rocks and concrete in there. Um, the other bathroom is over here. Completely outdated, but at least it's not vandalized. But completely outdated. Look at this thing. This thing's older than I am. Um, this is the, uh, the the floor things that they were supposed to use on the other side. They technically could have used new baseboards, but these, they put them on and they don't go all the way to the end, so you'd still have to use quarter round. Also vandalized, no lighting. Um, the last bedroom here, also vandalized. See the flooring, has got quarter round, it doesn't look good. It's all screwed up. You know, like I said, nice new windows, so missing the lighting. And then missing a door here where we just walk right through and walk right, you know, missing doors. Um, is this the air conditioner now? Anyways, let's go on to the pool here. Jacuzzi, uh, it's probably not functional. And then the pool is definitely not functional. If you can see here, that thing is, it's a fiberglass pool. It's all broken up and broken up and everything. You either have to fill it up with dirt or get a fiberglass uh, insert made or, you know, the hole's already dug. Put a, put a real pool in there, a concrete uh, gunite or marsite pool. Um, it is fenced in. It is in a great neighborhood. Now you know why it's so cheap. Um, I didn't really find an AC unit. It doesn't have any cracks or any, you know, stress on the foundation. Pool pump looks great. Pool pump looks great. My dad knows Yeah, I don't know if there's an air conditioner. We haven't seen one. Nothing on this side. Let's go check out the other side over here. Oh, did I rip my shirt? Uh, no. Cool. Alright, let's see. Nothing that way, maybe by the front. There's a garage, let me show you the garage as well. Garage has a newer electrical panel, that's a plus. That's only 400 bucks. You see this, how you the light's coming through? 
literally, this is like, like, I mean, you can stick your finger through this. It's like, it's paper. I mean, I don't know what happened. I wonder what they do when there's a hurricane. Yeah, let's go outside there and see. This is where the air conditioner is supposed to go, and it's missing. So this homeowner really did a number on this house. I guess they were pissed off the bank was taking it. Rusted door. That door has got to go. A lot of work, man. A lot of work. I would have stuck with the other property instead of this one. <laughs> but anyways, um, this is a great property if you can pick it up at the right price and renovate it. It costs you about thirty grand to renovate this house. And once you renovate it, you can sell it for like 160, 170, maybe even a little more, maybe 200. But uh, you know, at 110, it's not worth it. Anyways, um, I'll send this video to you. Say hi to your dad. I mean, to your son. <laughs>